Well, activities at the Nigerian Petroleum Development Company was brought to a halt earlier today um, in Edo State where protesting youths under the ages of Niger Delta Student Union government went on rampage. The youth who were drawn from the nine states of the region participating in a two-day intensive training workshop on Petroleum Industrial Act in Benin City are protesting over alleged sharp practices by management of the company. The youths blocked the entrance gate of the company for several hours, preventing entry and exit to demand that the management give them what is due them as captured in the blueprint for the training. Some of the things they accused the management includes the reduction in their training stipends and the removal of computer laptops, amongst others. As at the time of filing this report, the management of NPDC is yet to react to the allegations levelled against it. During the worship, they're supposed to give us a laptop. Funny enough, during the worship, they brought a bag with a cord without a laptop. As if we are illiterate, as if we are stupid. We don't know that that bag is supposed to have a laptop. And even they're supposed to give us funds to start up maybe businesses or fence for our school or cater for our school activities. One million naira. And yet, they, they, they don't want to keep to even the one million bag in. A total negligence on the affairs of students and the welfare of Niger Delta people. It is demeaning that a company as such, after making proper arrangements, proper uh, negotiation with uh, leadership, and then we organized the workshop, agreed on the workshop, this and otherwise. Getting here, we we begin to see changes and differences in what we had already agreed. You have uh, our students from Niger Delta, drawn from the United States of the Niger Delta, protesting here based on the fact that there was an agreement with MPDC for a workshop concerning PRA, Petroleum Industrial Act. And after the program, they were supposed to be mobilized with some certain amount of stipends and also transport inclusive. But as we speak, NDDC breached those agreements. We came here because of some certain reasons, and those reasons led us to a protest, and the protest led to a, a meeting inside. We felt that the meeting, the management team will be there, or the community relations department team will be there. But we were surprised that when we were going, just the manager's security and people that we don't even know, that doesn't have any say of taking decision that was there.